Read yeah, that's carousel. part of the thread there. Yeah. Okay, please take yeah. three minutes and read through this carousel. There is so much disinformation about Israel being spread and that it's getting people hurt. There are videos- By you, Deborah. <laughs> By you. There are videos from all over the world, including the U.S., of crowds, pro-Palestinian protesters attacking, beating, kicking- using pipes as weapons against Jews. What is she talking about? I have no idea what she's talking about. If there's a video like that that exists, I have not seen it. But let me also say this. If a video like that does exist, that's also really wrong. We can we can say it's really wrong to beat people, to beat Jewish people with pipes. That's of course, but wrong. It does that exist? But that doesn't justify military occupation in, an, in another country. I don't know. I don't know no. what she's doing here. I don't yeah. know what she's doing here in this thread, but then she goes into this whole cartoon section, which is, and it's a series of cartoons that um, even you've seen them on Instagram. Oh no, is that have been produced by, account? yes, that have been produced by a, a group of fascists that are to the right of Trump. So here we have, yes, scroll down. No, yeah, so. these are from the, yeah, the Israel account. These are complete propaganda. Yes, so. They absolutely are. And these these are these are absolutely cartoons that have produced that have been produced by a group. And I'm going to say this again, that is that is fascist and to the right of Trump. I don't know that people quite understand that. I It's almost as if they look at Israel and they think that Israel is just full of leftists that agree with them. I don't understand why this happens, but it does happen. And, you know, we've had this conversation where Likud, who is the is Netanyahu, who's governing power right now, they are very much a hard right government and they're not the most right right you have home party you have kosh which are the kahanahis um that are now called something else i don't know what they're calling themselves these days but this party was so far to the right that they were banned by the state of israel but now netanyahu has let them back into his coalition because he wanted to hold on to power so again why is it that somebody that would self-identify themselves as being a liberal or on the left in the united states spread this kind of thing I mean, does she not realize that this is entirely uh, created by fascists? Like, I mean, it's just wild to me. So, so she wants all, all the Palestinians to live in 25 miles in, in the West Bank. Like, <laughs> All right, here. Okay, so in the West Bank and Gaza, and you should support it too. What are, what are they talking about? Both uh, of these areas... I mean, okay, so the West Bank is full of, of settlements and they're expanding the settlements in the West Bank as we speak. How could they say this while expanding the, the settlements? Hebron, Ramallah, like you can go through uh, through the list. They're all full of, of, of settlements that are protected by the IDF. None of these areas are sovereign. I, that's just a wild statement for them to be making, especially now in 2021. Mm. I mean, especially given what started this current uprising or uh, rebellion was was the expansion of, of, of settlements and the evictions in East Jerusalem, right? So this is just incredibly disingenuous crap. Uh, I, all the way, all the way through. And so you'll love if you go down to the very end. I think there's nine tweets because I did a I did a Tina thing. <laughs> Well, this is the end. Okay, so there's one up there. Well, I so, see you. <laughs> so, yeah. so tweet number uh, ten, nine I'll was you. tweet number nine was was end. Like mm -hmm. she wrote end, and then then I said tweet. Then I did eleven. I did the number eleven. There it is. And I'm like reality. <laughs> I love that. Oh my gosh. Yeah. So there it is, um, end. She's and there not, I am number not, eleven reality. She's not smart. No, but why does she continue to do this? Uh, you know, this isn't the... Oh, and I, you know, what's really interesting to me about Deborah Messing too is the, the way she hated on Bernie Sanders more than once she made anti-Semitic claims about no, Bernie Sanders. Of let's course. order a cameo from that. her and make her say night, good things. Wait, order a what? A cameo. She has a cameo link on her account. Oh, I'm scared. I don't you, even want... <laughs> you order a thing and then she had like, she, you tell her what to say and she you has to make a video right? saying it. 